Hey everyone, Mike here from Video Maker, and you're watching our review of Gorilla Scheduling 6 and Gorilla Budgeting 6. All right, so how I'm gonna do this review is I'm gonna start by giving you a really high introductory level view of both softwares and the price to help you determine whether or not you frankly even wanna watch this video because the software is really not for everyone. Um, after that, I'll go into a deeper dive into the features of Gorilla Scheduling and the features of Gorilla Budgeting right after that. Then I'll go into who it's for and frankly who it's not for, because like I said, it's not for everyone. Um, and its value in the marketplace and kind of how much that price compares to your other options available. Gorilla Scheduling 6 is traditional film scheduling software with breakdown sheets, uh, strip boards, calendars, cast and crew information, uh, with integration of information like locations, shot lists, and storyboards. Now, Gorilla Budgeting 6, on the other hand, is traditional film budgeting software. It includes tools like globals, fringes, subgroups, tax credits, determinants, fourth level budgeting, uh, rate book, integration, and expense tracking. So if you want to buy either of these softwares uh, individually, they're $250 a piece, um, or you can buy them together for $430. Now that might sound really expensive, especially when you consider you can go onto Google and you can get a spreadsheet and some word processing software for free, or you can pay a little bit more and you can get you know, Microsoft Excel or Microsoft Word uh, that's much more robust, or if you can pay even more than that and get QuickBooks. Um, but you know, the real beauty of this software is it's very, very specific to filmmakers and has a robust selection of tools. You know, the history of this company goes back to these people who um, were programmers by day, but had a passion for filmmaking and were making films at night and on the weekends. And they found that the tools like Excel and Word were very, like, uh, very broad. They had to appeal to quite a few people and they didn't have the specific tools they needed for real, you know, film pre-production. So let's start with Gorilla Scheduling 6. Now, really what Gorilla Scheduling is, is a tool that takes your screenplay, you know, from whatever software you wrote it in, uh, scans it in, looks for key data points like character names and uh, scene locations, and uses those data points to try to build a, a shoot schedule for you. So you can import screenplays directly from your favorite screenwriting software, like Final Draft or Movie Magic Screenwriter, uh, or you can import story outlines and index cards from Storio. You can also drag and drop strips uh, on the storyboard. There are blackout dates like cast availability and uh, crew member availability, also equipment availability, um, etc. Um, you can sync screenplay and scheduling and import additions to your schedule from a screenplay. There's also enhanced strip boards. You can customize a strip board with appearance uh, options like labels, you can add design presets, uh, vertical versus horizontal view. You can automatically email a board to the cast and crew. There's also a feature called Called show screenplay by actions, characters, dialogue, uh, etc. And it's got over 40 video tutorials which are easily viewed from within Gorilla. It's got a built-in shot library to create a storyboard with shots for each scene. Uh, you can attach cast, equipment, and other breakdown elements to each shot. You can assign locations, which include location picture libraries, location mapping, and a location fact sheet. You can store your contacts, which include your cast and crew, agents and managers, companies you might have to deal with. You can automatically uh, email directly from inside Gorilla. There's also a really great calendar tool, which helps you track shooting schedules, rehearsals, meetings, location scouts, and you can print cast and crew call sheets monthly calendars, and all kinds of other stuff. Okay, so now let's get into the reason that uh, most of you, I'm sure, tuned into this video, the budgeting software. Um, Gorilla Budgeting 6. Okay, so we understand that, uh, you know, most video maker subscribers are not exactly what you would call accounting enthusiasts. And as a result, there's probably going to be some terminology here that doesn't make a lot of sense to you. Um, but for those of you that are into accounting, uh, you're really going to love this stuff. So Gorilla Budgeting 6 is industry standard budgeting software. Uh, it's got top sheet, accountant, and all kinds of detail levels. There's special budgeting like globals, fringes, subgroups, a fourth level detail, international currency support, uh, customizable captions, and a bunch of other stuff. Um, there's over 50 templates, uh, including templates for like shorts, uh, features, and documentaries. Uh, you can set up tax credits for different locations. You can attach them to groups. You can create individual tax credits. Um, you can also add an amount, like a flat rate or a percentage, to any production total. Um, it supports multiple currencies. 
Um, in fact, uh, you can globally change the currency of your entire budget from one currency to another. Gorilla scheduling uh, integration works with, uh, uh, lets you import cast and crew, uh, also other elements, locations from a linked schedule. Um, it does expense tracking, uh, tracks expenses against uh, other budgets, and also does uh, real-time balances. It has rate book integrations, access to over 13,000 union labor rates, um, and just like uh, Gorilla Scheduling, uh, it has a bunch of video lessons, uh, over 30 of them actually, that you can view uh, directly from within Gorilla Budgeting 6. Okay, so now let's consider who this software is for and who it's not for. So it's pretty clear by looking at it uh, that the software is not for very small teams or very quick projects. You know, if you're making a YouTube vlog, you don't need the software, right? Even if you're doing like local commercials, you don't need the software. If you're doing weddings, you probably don't need the software. But, you know, it's really for projects that are quite vast. You know, we're talking feature length films or even short films that are kind of vast in scope. We're talking multiple locations, you know, a wide uh, range of uh, crew and cast where you have to manage a bunch of contracts um, and schedules for that matter. You know, scheduling on even a small shoot can be pretty, uh, pretty complex when you're dealing with dozens of people. And so it's clear that this, this software is for these bigger projects. Um, you know, if you're a small team, you know, software like Excel is probably fine. Um, but when you need all of this minutia, it's probably because you have a project that's so big, you can't possibly keep track of it all in an efficient manner in software like Excel or, or, or Google Sheets or, you know, basic word processing. Now, when we consider Gorilla 6's value in the marketplace, the first thing we considered really was the aesthetic of the UI. Now, you know, it's not very pretty. But frankly, Gorilla 6 has such a robust wealth of features, and there are so few other options that do the same thing, we kind of overlook that. In fact, usually when we consider how pretty the UI is, it's because we have several choices, and that's the differentiating factor. But here we don't have that luxury. Um, however, there are a couple options out there like Celtics that are free and offer screenwriting, formatting, and management tools like contracts and client organization. Uh, and for a monthly charge, you get a full range of options that are similar to guerrilla scheduling and budgeting. Uh, depending on what your needs, that could cost $10 or $20 a month. The value comes with how long you might use any program before you need to pay to upgrade, or decide if a lease option like Celtics would be a good fit. It all depends on your workflow and your project's needs. If a one-time purchase is less expensive for how much you use the software, Gorilla 6 is surely robust enough to cover many, if not all, needs. Uh, keep in mind, though, that it takes around two years of leasing Celtics to match the cost of uh, Gorilla 6, though you may not get the same wealth of features. Also, if a scheduling and script writing tool is all you need, uh, and you already subscribe to Adobe Creative Cloud, you already have Adobe Story and can coordinate a schedule uh, and format your screenplay with that. Story also has the uh, stripboard integration to make scheduling easier. So that's it. That's our review of Gorilla Scheduling 6 and Gorilla Budgeting 6. Uh, if you'd like to buy either of these softwares, you can. Uh, there's a link in the description. Um, and you can actually go there and get a free trial. So, you know, might as well not spend the 250 bucks right off the bat, right? Um, also, we'll put a link to Celtics as well. Um, so you can go there and try that for free. Um, and if you like this shirt, there's a link there. You can buy, buy it and uh, support the channel that way. Um, as always, like, comment, subscribe, share, all that stuff. Uh, we want to know what you think and we want to know what you uh, have to say about this video and others. So please do that. Um, and uh, until next time, I'm Mike from Video Maker. So long.